Hey there, Sagittarius. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. This is going to be a general message. Take what fits your situation and leave what doesn't. If none of this hits home for you, just try a different message. I'm going to use the Animal Spirit Oracles and the Light Seers Tarot to see what's going on with you guys, or what's coming through anyways. And if you are interested in a personal reading, <clears throat> my email is in the description box below. Something is making you guys feel really uncomfortable. Just trying to open for your, your reading here. And there is this weird, like, walking on eggshells type of tension, man. Uh, let's see what that's about. For Sagittarius, what's going on? I feel like somebody's really trying to push your buttons here. Like, they are doing everything they can to upset you, to ruffle your feathers. Do not give it to them, guys. I'm telling you. Stop looking at the phone. Stop listening to the voicemails and reading the text messages or whatever it is um don't even let people tell you about what it is that they're saying like especially if these people are not standing up for you they're just trying to spread it too like they're trying to breed more drama out of this situation so like i feel like you already know where this is going but yeah be at home be with yourself right now that spirit you're going to bounce back from this. A rebirth is assured. Look at that. Be spirit. Sweet results await. You have so much better to focus on. Do not fucking let that shit get to you. All right. Be at home. Be with yourself and center. I'm getting a lot of Virgo energy with that. Yeah. Do not put your time and energy into that. Okay. Okay at all five is changes sevens are obstacles you're not going to let this obstacle change what you've got going here or all the work that you've done yeah exactly you have success and victory whether they believe in this stuff or not something is moving through them and trying to get them to mess with you it's it's don't let it work it's not going to work if you don't let it five six seven eight harmony balance and abundance coming in Six and eight is four. Foundations, eight of swords, page of cups. Yep, that's what I mean. They're trying to get you all caught up in this shit, but you don't have to be caught up in any of it. You know, maybe it doesn't make sense why some of them are doing that because you really thought you guys had something, you know, you had their back. They had your, you know, I thought we were family. I thought we were cool. I thought we were friends. What the fuck? I think the mask is falling off of somebody here. You're seeing somebody for who they really are. It's like a side of them that you never saw before. A side of them that you never even imagined. Somebody is really, um, I guess, just showing their ass here. It's not you. It's this person really trying to get to you. Yeah, seven of wands. So you're right to put up your boundaries. You are right to stand up for yourself. You are right to stand up for whatever it is you believe in. You have every right to, to put up boundaries and protect yourself. There are so many different ways that you can protect yourself. The first thing I want is for you to come out of your head and out of your heart with this situation because... Shit, unfortunately, this person is just not what we thought they were. You know, somebody's really got it out for you. But it's a personal problem. You have something they don't. You have the courage. You have the strength. You have the ability to do something on your own. I'm getting that this person is very codependent in situations that you are independent. This is jealousy. That's evil eye. What else do we have for Sagittarius? The Earth Mother, you bet. The Empress, absolutely. See, you're too grown for whatever this is, and I think that's why it bothers you so much. You had a lot of love for this person, and I think that you're still going to wish good things for them, but like, wow. You're going to have to pray for them at a distance. You know what I mean? 
This is not somebody that you, you're going to be able to keep around. You're going to want to block them on your phone and the internet is what I'm hearing. So like social media, all forms of communication. You're going to want to cut all ties is also what I'm hearing. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff you're going to want to do. But you're taking the lead. You're taking matters into your own hands. Again, it's like you're doing this on your own here. Or at least you're doing it with other powerful, um, independent individuals. But you're really harnessing that King of Wands energy here, taking the lead. Look at that lion in the background. Oh my gosh. Yeah, walking away from this because it's just, it's not exactly. It's, they've got hidden agendas, hidden motives, trying to set up booby traps and shit for you. Yeah, the Eight of Cups just came out. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, they're leaving shit behind or they're just mucking up the energy here. I'm telling you, this person is really trying to fuck you up here. They, they don't want you to have your Ten of Cups. They don't want you to have your Happily Ever After. They don't want you to have these things. Why? Because they're so pissed off that they don't have it yet that they're just going to go around taking it from other people. Maybe that's why you don't have it. I, I don't understand. How do people not fucking get it? This is what happens. You go around messing with other people's lives because you have ugly energy in you. That's why ugly things happen to you. That, that is exactly what makes you ugly on the inside. That is exactly why people that are good on the inside are repulsed by you. You wonder why everybody cuts you off. This is why. You really can't see it because I'm pretty sure everyone has explained it to you. This is just somebody that's not to be trusted, you guys. They're not at all. And I, I understand the frustration. I've been feeling it since I was just opening for the reading, but... Do not let them ruffle your feathers. Do not let them get to you like that. You have some really, really good stuff coming in. If anything, take it as a compliment. Because the universe is not going to, the, the whatever side, is not going to throw this kind of shit at just anybody. They're going to throw it at somebody who's about to expand some more. Who's about to walk off into their sunset and literally step into their happily ever after where the grass has always been greener and they finally get to live there. They, fi they finally get to frolic through the greener grass on the other side, you know? And this is just somebody that doesn't want you to go. A last minute ditch effort to grab onto your ankle and hold you back. No, don't leave me. It's like the D words that try to grab onto you as you're, you're climbing the ladder. Kick them in the face. I'm not saying to actually get physical with somebody here, okay? Don't go catching charges and shit. That is not what I said. <laughs> I just mean don't let people hold you back. You have every right to stand your ground and walk away because something is just, it's not even for the, for the birds, you know? It's not even for the birds. They don't even want it. I think I'm gonna... We have Gemini, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, Pisces, no, Scorpio, Leo, Libra, Taurus, Divine Feminine, and Venus. I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. I hope this message helps who it needs to, how it needs to. I love you guys, and I'll see you soon. Until then, stay beautiful.